Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.com. I came across this ice cube tower cooler from SunFounder and I was surprised of how well it performs. This ice cube, if you look closely, it cools all chips in the Raspberry Pi motherboard. Unlike other ice towers out there that they claim to be the best, they only cool the processor, which is the main chip of the Raspberry Pi. This ice cube is compatible with Raspberry Pi 3, Raspberry Pi 3 uh, B Plus, and Raspberry Pi 4. This ice cube comes with a clear plate on the bottom and all the necessary studs so you can mount it. It also comes with an additional fan in case you don't like that clear LED one. I'll do an open box and an assembly video in the future. Okay, here we have the kind of kit. This one is without the um, the ice cube. Uh, if we were doing it on a real environment, everything needs to be the same. But because I, I did the stress test at two different times, my room was at two different temperatures. So I at least use this as reference. It's currently about 72 degrees uh, Fahrenheit, 30 degrees about 25 degrees Celsius and I have a ceiling fan on the room if you notice on the bottom right monitor so okay I'm gonna go ahead and stress test this Raspberry Pi without the ice cube just using heatsink if you notice it is started at 520 at 48.7 degrees Celsius and in a matter of minutes it started climbing over 10 degrees Celsius so practically in two minutes it went from 48.7 to 63.7 and climbing now you have an idea of how fast the temperature could climb up under stress this here is my X gaming PC which is now my home server if you notice I'm using the Noctua NHD15 premium CPU cooler and it uses the same concept, a tower-like uh, cooling, just like the ice cube on the Raspberry Pi. And it has been working well on my PC. I know for a fact it's going to work well on the Raspberry Pi. If you want to know the exact dimensions and the specifications, you can find the link in the description box below. I'll use the standard American way to measure things. I'm going to go ahead and run the uh, stress test is 1039 and the operating temperature is 31.6 degrees Celsius is practically freezing. And notice that within minutes it climbed up to 37 degrees. Now, like I said earlier, use this information as reference only. I wanted to compare it using the exact same conditions but because I run the uh, uh, stress test five hours later my room has a different temperature now it's about 68 degrees Fahrenheit 20 degrees Celsius and if you see underneath the right monitor the, the fan is actually off so use this as reference notice that it's still uh, in between 37.4 36 degrees Celsius so it has an average of about 37 degrees which is awesome now you can find the link to this ice cube and all the specifications in the description box below and unlike other tutorials there's nothing else additional that needs to be mentioned I mean this is by far the best cooling system out there for the Raspberry Pi and I'm not just saying that you saw it for yourself so now you have a really good system to mine cryptocurrencies or use this as a cloud storage like I showed you before and don't have to worry about your Raspberry Pi heating up thank you for watching this video my name is Miguel if you have any questions feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.